So this is a quick tutorial about how to use cooler.adobe.com. So I've gone to the home page and you know you can set up a, an account and save things to your account. So I'll go ahead and, and I've registered so I'll go ahead and sign in here. And once I've signed in, I'm, I can go through and look at the pre-made themes that are already available to me, or I can go and create my own theme. So I'll click on the Create, and I'm going to create it from an image. I can use the Flickr images. Or I can upload an image. Now once I have a theme created, I can save it, and then I can use it anytime I log in. If you look here, you can see my themes that I've created. Now in order to create a theme from this for PowerPoint, what you need to be able to do is click on the icon to make changes and view color values. And here it gives me all the numbers I need to use in order to put these colors into PowerPoint. So let's real quick open up PowerPoint. On the design tab, click on colors and choose create a new theme colors. So here you can take each of these colors and change them to match the colors that you created in Cooler. So for example, for my dark background, click on more colors, custom, and then I can input the colors that I needed from these numbers right here. So I can type in for red, the value 49, for green, the value 59, and blue, the value 89. You can see those match up right here to the 49, 59, 89 of this blue color. Click OK, and now it has that blue as my background. Now for my light background, I can pick one of the other colors. Again, go in and click Custom, and then just choose my colors that I want to use. So if we're doing this one right here, we've got the 191, 144, 86, and we say OK. And now we've got that as the light background. And you can go through and update each of these. When you're done, name it as something so that you remember what it is for using it again, and click Save. Now in the future, anytime you want to use this color theme, you'll be able to choose it from your custom list.